Brock Lesnar is looking to further his unmatched legacy. Well, the only man to hold championships in the NCAA, WWE, IWGP in Japan, and the UFC. And given the odds here, I suspect this one will be quick and not so painful. Yeah. Brock Lesnar still enters every match as the odds-on favorite. Yeah, I would never predict a Lesnar to lose, Saxton, because you can enter Suplex City, but you will never come out the same. Lesnar going to work now. It's all academic from here. His signature slam. Roman faltering some. He looks incredibly motivated, though. Don't expect him to be down for long. The important thing is that he doesn't overreact here. He's taken on a little bit of damage, but it's nothing he can't overcome. I'm not going to go so far as to say he can't win this match, but things certainly aren't looking good for him right now. Man, Braun Strowman, what offense. Of course, we all recognize Braun Strowman as a legitimate main eventer, but remember, guys, it wasn't that long ago that he was considered the black sheep of the Wyatt family. He's inflicting some serious pain here. So damaging. As Byron was saying, Braun Strowman absolutely took orders from Bray Wyatt at one point. But that all changed following the 2016 WWE Draft when Strowman broke out on his own and proved that he was indeed a monster among men. And he did that call by defeating two, three, sometimes even four superstars at the same time. In 2017, the WWE Universe saw the immeasurable power of Braun Strowman unleashed in handicap matches. The monster among men annihilated teams of two, three, and four men and made it look so easy it was almost difficult to comprehend. On the February 6th episode of Monday Night Raw, the Leviathan Braun Strowman absolutely destroyed four local competitors and made it look like a child's play. Corey, I remember when we called the action that night on Raw and Braun Strowman was simply unstoppable. The easiest way to put it is that Braun Strowman doesn't care if he's in the ring against local competitors or WWE superstars because Braun Strowman just wants to tear people apart. There aren't many individuals who are just as dominant in handicap matches as they are in traditional singles matchups. What we saw in that match from Braun Strowman was almost like witnessing a massacre right in front of our eyes. One of the competitors just sprinted out of the ring. In handicap matches, what would be challenging for another superstar is done with little to no effort from the monster among men. This is a type of power we've never experienced before. And he hits a hellacious neckbreaker. Check out Braun Strowman's offense. How could Brock Lesnar just dig deeper right now and find his way out of this one? At this point, you have to ask how much more he has to give here in this handicap match. This match certainly isn't trending in the right direction for him. He's going to need a change in momentum and fast. Oh. Oh, I think this man needs business. What's Brock Lesnar putting together here? Oh, boy. Could be a game changer. He's got him covered. And he kicks out. Wow. I think it goes without saying, guys. Brock Lesnar is one of the most dominant forces WWE has ever seen. Believe it or not, when Lesnar won his first WWE championship, I think he actually caught a lot of people off guard. This is not the place where you want to underestimate your competition. Absolutely not. Brock Lesnar going to work now. Byron Corey 
brings up a good point. When Lesnar defeated The Rock for his first WWE title in 2002, a lot of folks thought the People's Champion would hand Lesnar the very first defeat of his blossoming career. But Brock did quite the opposite that night, beating The Rock in the main event of SummerSlam, sending the People's Champion away for half a year in the process. Watch Brock Lesnar put it together here! Oh, boy! Ziggler is being outworked here tonight. Where do you think he should go from here? There it is! Lesnar just put the exclamation point on this match! Game over. Incredible. Oh, man, what a hit. Knocked right off the apron. Lesnar. Pretty timeout time. Kamara Lock is in. I think this is the beginning of the end, Michael. Momentum is fully in the corner of Brock Lesnar now. As Michael alluded to, Dolph Ziggler has gone from introducing himself to making his name known. And Corey Ziggler earned that reputation by beating some of sports entertainment's biggest names. All right, Byron, think about it. Edge, The Miz, Randy Orton. Heck, Ziggler even ripped WWE of the... We got a couple. After a win like that, you better get yourself checked. And that's the kind of action we've come to expect here on Raw. What an amazing match. Oh, man, what a hit. Knocked right off the apron when Brock is feeling it. Good luck to you. Watch Brock Lesnar put it together here. Oh, boy. dominance. This might be the opportunity he needed. Drew McIntyre really needs to dig down deep and fast. Let's Brock Lesnar put it together here. Oh, boy. With an F5. Bang. Is that it? Is it over? Drew McIntyre really needs to dig down. Shoulders on the mat. I say Drew McIntyre's career is a story of two completely different chapters. McIntyre himself would tell you his first chapter didn't quite go as planned, but boy, chapter two is a whole other story. The offensive front blaster is working well right now. Right above the nose, it looks like. Michael, I like your analogy of McIntyre's career as two different chapters. And while chapter one didn't necessarily blow anybody away, there was a foreshadowing of his future success. Oh, even Mr. McMahon himself called McIntyre a future world champion, which of course later came true in 2017 when McIntyre defeated Bobby Roode for the NXT Championship. Oh boy, he is rolling. Look at that, Braun Strowman now bleeding profusely. If I was Brock, I would quit messing around with people's minds and start messing with his opponent's body instead. Brock moves in. This could be it. And a third time! Game, set, match. This one is over. but it looks like that one should do the trick. Brock is definitely enjoying himself right here. Brock Lesnar seems to relish this. What's Brock Lesnar put it together here? Good attack on time. Come on, Lock is in. Wow, I'm just as surprised as you guys are. Has been eliminated. Brock Lesnar has done it. 
an absolutely inspiring, brutal, and epic matchup. Let's take another look at what made that handicap match one of the best ever. That was just one of those matches that the men involved should just be proud to be a part of. A legendary performance. There's good, there's great, and then there's downright unbelievable WWE action. Ladies and gentlemen, you just got a taste Here is of the your unbelievable kind. Too many people that wouldn't have tapped out to that. It doesn't matter which side of the fence a guy is on in a handicap match. The idea of the whole thing is very unsettling. I, for one, am glad it's over. What a great match we just saw here on Raw. Thank you to everybody at home for choosing to spend part of your Monday night with us.